Wow, look how nice you look. You have to tell us how old you're gonna be. It's a backpack that coordinates Whoa. with the lucky. Hi, and welcome to another vlog. If you've never seen a vlog before, it's kind of like a behind the scenes, much more casual version of the sit down videos, although I'm sitting in the place where I normally film. I just film, filmed the Guerin-Law uh, holiday collection. It's beautiful, so I'm gonna edit that now. Um, I'm also gonna pick my parents up at the airport in like another, no, they're not even on the plane yet, so <laughs> in a little while. Um, so I'm gonna edit the this video while I'm doing that, but just wanted to go back in time a little bit because it was about a week ago maybe, I had a Zoom session with my good friend here on YouTube, Allison Chase. So she also offers beauty consultations on skincare, makeup, any brand, but I do know her as my Chanel expert. I actually talked a lot about Chanel with her and I'm gonna share with you what I learned. She gave me some really great tips and tricks. So I'll show you a little clip, but if you do sign up for one, you just meet with her on Zoom, not just, you get to meet with her on Zoom and she'll show you how to use your products, see what you have. You don't need new products for it. In fact, you get to maximize what you already have. So I'll course talk about that when I do the sit down video but I was really lucky to be able to meet with her and then after that oh I wanted to show you the rodeo products what they looked like because I took a nap so I do want to show you a clip of that so let's go to that first and I think we went to dinner after that so let's go to that clip and I'll meet you on the other side of that here is the makeup I actually haven't touched it up since I put it on how many year, years not years <laughs> um, I think that was about six or so hours ago and I just took a nap and I just woke up to put eye drops in and put a lip on so I used this one that many of you liked and actually I like it too now <laughs> this one that I thought I wouldn't like because it was too um what's the word plum or like purpley but it actually is quite pretty it's not anything that's too purpley but it's just a really beautiful shade de mask it's the Lip Chic by Chantecai. I'm so impressed with this makeup though. I, Like I said, I took a nap, a good hour nap, and this is the same thing that I applied so many hours earlier. So that powder looks right. I think I'm gonna repowder. I haven't even repowdered. And um, I'm just wearing here, a uh, big mess here, but I'm just wearing a slip dress. <laughs> if you can see, a slip dress. Uh, this cardigan, my Maj cardigan. He's such a big mess. It's that's how messy it gets here. Uh, but we're gonna go to dinner. Maybe I'll take a couple of shots of the food because it's really good. And then see what we're up to tomorrow. Well, I might have to film this one again. And then I'm gonna film the whole video of so many things coming in and some exciting PR that I've never received before. So I don't know if it's gonna make it into this video or not. Uh, and then we'll see what we get up to, but let's go to dinner. I'm also gonna wear my Colby Combat boots with this. So I don't know. Right now I just have slippers. So you can actually see in the mirror there what I'm wearing. It's a slip dress, like a mid-length one, and then this sweater. I just wanna mention, I like the slip. Someone discovered some products they like. Because it doesn't, what did you say? Make it old. No, no it old. but you said it doesn't show your, I think you call them cracks. <laughs> cracks. She has a <laughs> Chanel water fresh tint on and that she really liked the Merit blush. So it was nice and like just glowy on her face and we didn't powder, right? And we used actually the Rodeal um, Peach Low Later also. And then we're gonna unbox that later, right? Yes, I will help her unbox things. <laughs> That's why I came here for. <laughs> That's not true. You liked a perfume. You really liked a perfume. Oh I yeah. Had. House of Oud's uh, Cypress Shade. Do you want to tell them how old you're going to be this year? Look how nice you look. 80. Eight, 80 years old. So we 80. would like to know what are your, because people ask me why do I look so young, but this is m most of the reason because this is, if this is 80 for me, and I got really lucky with the genetics, but there are other things you do. So I don't go under the sun. We stay out of the I, sun. I stay out of the sun. Even the Philippines, I stay out of the sun. I like fruits and vegetables. Fruits and vegetables? Yes. You eat a lot of those. What do you drink? Well, water. Yeah, and then exercise, of course. Yeah. What else? That's all you do to stay 
like you look yeah. like this at 80 and and take care of my kids thank you for your advice because almost 50 this is almost 80. <laughs> i think you're just genetics says a lot though yes well, you just told me i didn't know this uh -huh. what, the job she wanted after her kids <laughs> got out of the house i didn't know Hardstrom. makeup lady so we have here <laughs> oh my jeans don't look pretty on camera but i kept these jeans because i really like them so i kept the citizens jeans i'm glad i did they're very comfortable but i ordered some um levi's and we have someone taking over my space here yes nice are you gonna film us a video so we're just uh, headed to dinner. I'll probably take a few clips of what we're eating, um, but then I wanna show you this dress tomorrow. My parents bought it for me today, we went shopping. So I'll go ahead and show that to you when we unbox, I think. Yeah, when we unbox. So we're off to dinner. dress yesterday it's like a green shade by stout and she'll show it to you later it's very cute but we thought we would do the byredo palette on her because because she wanted to do like a greenish shade so we're gonna try this on you so we're gonna start though with the chanel Le beige in the shade medium and for her darker spot we would go with the charlotte tilbury she likes this the um the color character in medium I'm wearing this too, I'm, but in medium plus. We're gonna go under the eye with the Rodeal Low Lighter. Under the eye. Brows really fast, so she also likes the Gucci eyebrow pencil. She has no brows here, so. <laughs> so she plucked her brows in the 60s, so I plucked my brows in the 90s. <sighs> don't, don't pluck your eyebrows. I'm gonna take the khaki green first. Pretty. Love it, love it, love it. She likes something that's not powder, so we have the Merit Terracotta. Take Chantecaille's Nude. I'm just taking this um, foundation. I'm gonna use it as a little concealer on that dark spot. And add a little bit more of your blush. Okay, and then she likes the Sizzly Lipstick. And then I taught her the little trick where you can run that around the edges of your lipstick. And here's mom's stout dress and my heels. <laughs> That's why she wanted the green makeup. This is the, the perfume she loves. So this is the House of Oud in the Cypress shade. Um, the one that I loved, but she actually likes it better. So, ready? Smells so nice. We're gonna open a couple of things just because there's something in here that I know I wanna get out. So this is an order I made from Victoria Beckham Beauty. One of the lip shades because I love it so much and you know I must love it because I have so many other lip shades. I don't really need anything. So this is this shade, Spark because my sister liked it so much, she wanted it and they don't ship to Hong Kong or I don't think they do. We tried to find if they did, but I couldn't figure it out. So I just gave her mine and then I ordered one. I like it. I also picked up the bronzer finally. I picked up the refill because, I don't know, I just wanted to save on packaging and I wasn't sure of the shade. So I picked up three, so we're gonna try this out. We're gonna open one more at least. There's a note in here and it says, we're so happy that you found a good haul fragrance that's out of your comfort zone to share with your audience. Because I they, I told them this was out of my comfort zone and they said, thank you for your partnership. All our best, the Twisted Lily team. Twisted Lily team. Ooh. Ooh. So this is the one that I selected. Cute. Oh. Oh, look at the bottle. Got a necklace. It does. It has its own jewelry. <laughs> so it has like a, a hair clip okay. and a jewelry. jewelry. <laughs> you have to really like vanilla to like this one though. Oh, it's very vanilla-y. Okay, so this is the bottle. They're now carrying this line on Twisted Lily and they have lots of different choices. 
uh, top notes are vanilla, heart note, tonka bean, and then base note, white musk. The light is gone now, so we'll open the rest of the things tomorrow, and then we're gonna go to dinner. The other thing I have on, I have Chouchette for my blush, Chouchette, and then I went over it with the, uh, I went over it with the Clay de Peau. Good morning. Today's the last full day with my parents here. So what we're gonna do is head to a farmer's market. Never been there before, so not quite sure how it is, but if there's anything interesting, I'll show you. And then we have lots of unboxing, not lots of, but I'm gonna say maybe five or six packages that need to be unboxed. And then we're gonna take them out to a happy hour and I'll take you along for the ride. We're back from the farmer's market. We had um, some of the fresh fruit and vegetables and some chicken that we didn't get there. We got somewhere else. But we're gonna go ahead and unbox. But this is the uh, sweater dress that my parents got me. It's by Paige. I'll of course link it below. And it's uh, got a little bit more weight to it. I tried the small versus the medium. The medium was better. So I'll show you the full length in a bit. But let's go ahead and unbox some of these things. Oh, also I liked the color. Did I say that yet? Even though I think it's called camel, it's got some pink in it. So I think it's a really nice blush color. Um, so let's go ahead and open this though. And I know what this is. It's by Common Air. They sent this to me complimentary. So thank you so much. I'm in touch with the founder of the company. She just wanted to refresh my supply. So this is the Common Air Vitamin C Serum. Actually, this is really good for you to treat. Do you use a Vitamin C Serum? No. Oh, That'd okay. Nice. We're gonna have her try this tonight because your skin is, is mm. it oily or dry? It's dry. It's dry. Okay, so actually this might be really nice. So it's a vitamin C serum, but if you open it and it's excellent for travel, it's in these little oh. capsules, you apply it to your face. <laughs> mm. So you apply it like this, um, and it's good for evening because it's moisturizing and it Cute. feels really uh, refreshing and like supple in the morning. So thank you so yeah. much for sending these over. So we're gonna try I, this. I'm not gonna try it. Yeah, we're gonna try yeah. it. That is Common Air's vitamin C. So Carrie and I are in touch every once in a while. She is one of the co-founders of the company. So thank you so much. This was sent by the Hut Group. It's some obviously some Espa items, but I don't know what's in here. From what? Some people have told me they're carried at maybe spas, but I hear good things. Oh, nice. Okay, mm -hmm. so here's inside, and there's a little note. Um, we hope you will love your new skin products for glowy and radiant skin. Excited to hear what you think. Ellie and the Espa team, thank you so much for sending this over. So let's see what we have. So we have here an overnight glow enzyme peel. Overnight peel for glowing, refined and replenished skin. Skin. This is what the bottle looks like. Let me know if you've tried this because I have not tried this before. And we also have here a, an Espa Optimal Skin Pro Serum. I love serum. serum. Again. Yeah, intensely nourishing, nutrient rich serum for radiant skin. Here, let's see your hand. So it comes in a little dropper. Oh, what nice. Is this morning, night? What? Oh, it has a nice, like, herbal smell mm -hmm. almost, right? Mm -hmm. uh, it says, after cleansing and toning, warm a few drops uh, into your palms, gently smooth over face and neck. It's really hydrating feeling. I like it. You like it? I like it. I love it. And it's vegan, it says. 
Then we have some purchases. Now this is what I was excited about. Hmm. Not that the other things weren't exciting, but I purchased these. And if you've been on my vlogs before, I've been on a Monos luggage kind of um, <laughs> kick. Started with my husband getting one, and then I got one, and then my parents got one. Two. <laughs> they, they got two. They traveled with them this time. Did you like them? Yes. What, what did you say you liked the best about the? Because I have to open. I can open the outside to get my Kindle. Uh, what did you say about the wheels? It's so quiet compared to the rest. Of, like don't 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 don't. And that's my so quiet. <laughs> it does have really smooth uh, wheels. I I think I saw a Nordstrom. Like you can try them at Nordstrom. I don't. It was just a really quick thing I read. So if you want to see how smooth the wheels are and what I'm talking about or what she's talking about, I think you can try them at Nordstrom. I'll see if I can find Very out more information. Quiet. But yeah, I just saw it on the email. They don't know who I am. I just. When I like a product, I continue to talk about it and will try a lot of other things that they make. <laughs> so, not sponsored by Monos, but they if they want to call me, they can. <laughs> so I picked up the packing cubes, and I know many of you are packing cube fans, but these looked different because they also can compress. Wow. Yeah, they not only are just like a packing cube, but you can take the, I'll show you. This is what I like, and they do a really good job of illustrating this on their site. And I don't see other packing cubes that look like this, and their zippers and um, everything are really nice. So here's your packing cube, right? So you put in clothes. Yeah. Yeah? And then you zip it up, and you close it up like this. So now it's closed. But it also has this extra zipper on it so that you can then compress it. So... Then, yeah, you can you can um, take out all of the excess yeah. air, yeah. and then you can get it as compact as you want oh, or as yeah. it will go. Wow. So there are four, now you like this too. So the, I got a set of four, larger size, and then a square size, and then a rectangle, and then a smaller rectangle. So I got a size of four. These are, I think, gray. And I also got a set of six. So I don't know why I needed this other one, but they had it. They go out of stock all the time. So when they went into stock, I just got them. Oh, so there's, oh, they're different sizes. So this is in the six pack. So this looks smaller than the smallest one. So this is the smallest one in the four pack and this is the smallest in the six. So you have various sizes. So there's this and then this size. Then that's a good idea. This side, right? This side, I don't know what's duplicates here. I'm gonna have to figure it out. And then there's this size and then there's this size no, yeah so this is the six pack and then there's a four pack so if you want them and they don't have them in stock you can always um, give your email address so they'll let you know when they're in stock so I'm excited about this one okay this one you're gonna want one after well I don't know if you're gonna want this one because it's a Whoa. it's a backpack that Whoa. coordinates with the luxury so it comes like this so this is the brown shade oh it's got some like warm which actually works really well with this sweater yeah. um but i thought this was interesting i think they have some fabric ones that are harder to wipe down but this vegan i think you can e easily wipe it and also disinfect it is my guess and here's the interior if you want to see so there's a little bit of flannel here a pocket i guess you could fit a laptop if you wanted to but i that's what i have my other one for but i'll show you in a minute why this might go with something else and then it has a zipped here and then it has another mesh here and then it has this zipper so there's something I think you can put like shoes in there if you want to keep them separate from the rest of your luggage I think yes, but then is. there's also you like this yes, and then there's this other pouch back here which you wow, can put a Kindle in pouch. <laughs> but there's also another this pouch so there's this pocket that these are interchangeable this is again not sponsored but I just <laughs> I'm so fascinated by their products so this one you have to do something like you pull this tab right here and it releases this you have to pull this tab and it releases all of these little things and then you have this separate thing like that she purse. says you could use as a purse. But I think they mentioned you could kind of pre-pack these and then attach different ones depending on what you need. So I think this would be good for like um, liquids that you take on the airplane because 
if you're not like TSA pre-check or depending on if you're traveling internationally, sometimes you have to remove your liquids. So I think this is a really great place in case for some reason it spills and then there's lots of coarse pockets in here. And then there's almost like a plastic thing in here, plastic um, pouch, not pouch, but the zippered area with plastic. Um, and then there's this, I don't know, this little hook probably for keys so you don't misplace them. And then, so here's the inside of that. Oh, they really see. think of everything. That's what I like. They really think things through and so it's functional. I really like that. And minimal and cute. Very simple, but design that makes a lot of sense. So, so I would have this ready to go. So I would have my liquids, everything in here, just ready to go and then take this bag whenever I travel. So there's, would you wear a backpack? Oh yeah. You would? If I like it. Oh, let's bust up this order. This is so cute. And then when you uh, use your roller bag, the handle goes here so that it's not flopping all wow, over the place. That is so neat. And then you, you don't have to be like backpack, you can go like this one like this. Yeah, I like it. It's cute. It turned out cuter than I thought. And the logo here, the label or the, what do you call it? The, I don't know what you call it. The logo is very minimal, so it's not like sticking not, out. It's yeah, it's not like advertisement. Yeah, especially on something like this design. So this is the backpack by Monos. But I have a link below in case you want to look at that. Then we have this one. It's the hybrid. And then I think I'm done with this luggage for a while. <laughs> it's nice. So this one doesn't have zippers. Okay, so this one is like a, I think this is plastic, but then this is like aluminum. So it's like different parts or different materials. So I think the places where you would have impact are the metal materials and it has no uh, zipper on it. So it has these and it opens like this. Whoa. So yeah, let's look at the inside. But it has the same, oh gosh, it has the same mechanism. I like this, whoosh. This, it has the same setup as the carry-on where it has this that goes over like this and then Zipper like everything same. Everything was yeah the same as yours. But I think size wise it's a little bit bigger. Yeah, I mean it says carry on, so you'll have to check dimensions depending on your airline and all that. But I just thought it's different in case I don't bring my laptop or if I put my laptop in the backpack. So there's this as well. <laughs> now we're gonna go and um, go to happy hour now okay. and yeah. I'm and then try it. Yeah, and then try it. I just wanna try it with one hand. Okay, so here's mom with the backpack just so you can see the size. And how tall are you? Five, three and a half. Five, three and a half. <laughs> okay, so this is how, it's like pretty substantial, I think, especially if you're that size. Yeah, it's very both, but I, for, some, for me, I don't wanna do it like this. But it's probably better for your back. Yeah, I know, but you're like backpacking. <laughs> like this. I'm like, I just wanna like this. So here's the backpack on me. I'm about three to four inches taller than my mom. Here's the side view of the backpack, just so you can see the scale. So I'll let you know how it works out for me. But I'll show you the dress too. So here's the page dress that I got yesterday, actually, that my parents got me. No, not yesterday, the day before. This is a medium. I tried the small on, um, which was fine, but I just liked this drape a little bit better for this uh, fabric. It felt a little heavier, too, so I wanted to go with this one, but it has this cut out here, so it's just off the shoulder right there, but everything else, really comfortable. Of course, these are not shoes I'd wear. I'd probably wear my, um, my Stuart Weitzman shoes, the... Uh, um, the combat boots, the Colby ones. Um, and I wore them with some suede mules that are the same shade, almost as that backpack. So that worked out really well. It does have slits on the side as well. Not too high, but there are slits on the side, just right above the knee. I actually got a few more packages in that I wanted to unbox with you. So we'll do this one first and then I'll actually film this video. And then we're gonna open a couple of Chantecaille boxes that look really exciting. But this is from Victoria Beckham Beauty. They sent this to me complimentary. So thank you so much to the Victoria Beckham Beauty team. So these are their new blushes. They sent all of them over. So I'm actually going to try them on for you. I'm gonna try and figure out a way to do that. 
Here's all the information. I'll make sure to read it during the video so we can take a look really closely at everything. And like I said, we'll try them on. And these are the five shades. So thank you so much Victoria Beckham Beauty team for sending these over. Can't wait to try them. In fact, I think that video is going up before this one. So I'll make sure to try them all on my cheeks in case you haven't seen that one yet. As always, I'm going to take some photos before I use the product. So just finished filming the Victoria Beckham Beauty blush video. Oh my gosh, they're so pretty. So again, if you haven't seen it, I think it's already up or I don't know the order. So if it's not already up, <laughs> it'll be up soon. But I got a couple of packages from Shantika that I wanted to open with you. I think I know what one is, but I'm really confused by the size of the box of the other one. We do have a smaller box here. So let's see what this is. And I ordered my Chanel items overnight. Ooh overnight so those will arrive tomorrow and then I'll film it'll be one of those late night filming things and I'll post it um, pretty late <laughs> as soon as it's ready okay so we are so thrilled to share our holiday pearl collection with you we hope these precious compacts will bring you joy fun and luminosity to your skin face and vanity so it looks like this so I'm excited to open these. So again, thank you so much for your support. That is the only reason why I receive any of this. It's because you watch, like, subscribe, comment, all of those great things. So thank you so much. This is the packaging. It's like a white pearlized kind of finish. And this is the eye sheen in Baroque. So here is the case that it comes in. It's like a satin pink case. Oh, so pretty. Here's what it looks like. All these individual pearls on here and then it says Chantecaille on the side of course I'll swatch these in the video when I do it Ooh, okay this is so different than I thought it would look and it's coming across as like a more of a pinky shade up there but here it looks more like a bronzy shade that's so interesting so I'm guessing there's some like shift to this shade like depending on the angle <laughs> because it does look more bronzy here but then I turn it like this and it's more of like a plummy kind of pinkish shade so really interested to give this a try so that looks stunning of course and so so pretty look at that I want to say I read some of that they're hand placed I'm not sure but I do recall reading that somewhere this is one of those ones that's hard to use because it's so pretty then we have the cheek color here in Okoya Okoya here's the bag another satin bag so these are great gift items for your Shantikai fans and again, we have the beautiful pearl. Let me show it to you. That is stunning. So, so pretty. Ooh, this shade looks really lovely. So I know that the um, the one that they came out, I think it was the Flower Power. I don't know if it's the same kind of formula, but that one was much lighter. Um, but this one, it's really vibrant. So I think this is going to work for a lot of people. So excited to give this a try these are just like they're almost too pretty to use though and i'm so so like of chills i'm so excited to see this one in person i've just seen pictures and this one again in the pink bag same pearl design wow that is almost too beautiful to use it i almost wish i had a second one just so i could keep this one and then use the other one but you know, of course we will try this how gorgeous that is so beautiful. Just to look at is so beautiful. That is really one of the most beautiful items of makeup I've seen ever. So stunning. Then, I don't know if you noticed, but there are also two other items in here. So they sent over the, oh great, the Next Generation Eye Base products because I've been so curious about them. I was going to pick them up anyway just because I use their concealer, the Real Skin Plus for my eye base, but now I've got these to try. So I'll let you know how they work out. So I've got light, there are two shades and they sent over both. So that's perfect. So I can swatch them for you when I try them on. So we have light and medium. It looks like medium is the same shade as my the palm of my hand. So you can see the difference. Thank you so much Shantika for sending these over as well. I'm really, really looking forward to trying all of them. Now, <laughs> there's this, which I'm really confused about. Like, I don't know what this could be. It's this, this is how big this box is. So I don't know what they were sending over. Usually the boxes that they send over are not this size. 
Yeah, and it's from Shantikai. Usually they tell me what they're sending, so I don't know what this is. <laughs> Curious if you've already guessed what it is, but I don't know what this could be. <gasps> wow. Oh, I'm so excited. I was not expecting this. Wow, okay, it says thank you for all of your love and support this past year. We're excited to share our first ever beauty advent calendar inspired by, by our love of wildlife. We hope each delightful surprise brings joy to your day. Thank you, thank you so, so, so much. I love advent calendars. I know some people are kind of like iffy about advent calendars, but when I saw theirs go by, I thought they really included some beautiful items that are really things that I use all the time. So that is very exciting. But I do, I love advent calendars. I know some people, <laughs> I don't really love them, but I do. I mean, I grew up with the chocolate ones, but I love makeup, so I love makeup ones. So this is the box. And then you open it like this. And it has here 12 separate boxes. So if you're getting this for yourself and you want to be surprised, then I would stop watching now. So thank you so much for tuning in as always. But if you want to see what's in here, I will do that it's just so you can see. But for me, I know I'm always just a little bit disappointed when they open the advent calendars on YouTube because I would want it to be a surprise. Kind of like when I was a child, I had the chocolate advent calendar and it was always a surprise which chocolate it would be that day. So if you want to keep this as a surprise for yourself and you're going to get this, then I do appreciate you tuning in. But if you do wanna see this, I'm going to open every drawer for you. So let's go ahead with number one, because I can't honestly remember what was in what. But it says, I wanted Shantikai to be the first skincare company based on flowers. We proudly blend pure and luxurious quality, scientifically forward technology, I'm just reading what's in here, and botanical ingredients into all we do. We are committed not just to the best products, but also to philanthropy and conservation. In creating a brand, we created a platform with a voice for change and now Shantikai helps conservationists all around the world protect the ocean environment, endangered animals, and endangered plant species. It is an integral part of our brand. Sylvie Shantikai and I love that. Ooh, so you have a lovely Rose de May face oil. So these are gonna be great for me for travel. So I love taking these items with me, but sometimes the containers are a little bit too big. So I'm going to definitely use these as my travel. Although this is glass, but I love this. This is the most beautiful face oil without being greasy on the skin. It always absorbs really well and doesn't interfere with makeup. So when I need a little bit extra hydration, I will use that. So that's a lovely item. Then this right here is, let's see. Ooh, this is a full size lip veil in Honey Pot, which is one of their most popular, I think one of their most popular shades. I, I think it is. I mean, I love this shade, but it's honey. Actually, that's so funny because this may have been one of the very first Shantikai products I purchased ever. So it's because my mom bought it and then I liked it so much I went ahead and ordered it myself. So that's kind of, oh, that's really special that that's in here. So I have fond memories of that shade. So that's number two. Number three, I even remember it was in San Diego that she got it at the, I think the Nordstrom there. Number three, we have, oh, this is a lovely shade. The Luminescent Eye Shade in Zebra. Here's the front of it and then the inside looks like. It's the lighter of those um, pinkier shades that came out, I think it was last year, the last year, something like that but they were the newer ones, Zebra and Crane. That's in number three. This is number four. That's also a full size, by the way. We have a, oh, cute, a Fossil Longa Slash Black Mascara in a little size. Ooh, another great travel one. You know how much I love this. These are like really good products. So here's a teeny tiny little one. So cute, but it's my Holy Grail mascara. So, you know, I'm definitely going to use that. Five is this size right here. Ooh, gold recovery mask. I don't actually have this. I have like the gold cream, but I haven't tried this. So this will be new to me. So again, it's the gold recovery mask. This is the number six. Like, I don't remember what's in here. So it is like Christmas for me. Open. Oh, wow, I love this. Stress Repair Concentrate Plus. 
I was just thinking about how my, the one I'm using now, I need to open my new one. I, I love that these are little sizes because I travel with all of these things and I'm always trying to decant them into something else. Love this product. I love it. This is going to last a while. I know it's small looking. I know this is a small size, but this is going to last a while, even though it's tiny because you just need the littlest bit. So this is a great one to pick up if you want to try these in smaller sizes because I know that it adds up when you buy the full sizes. What a great way to try some lovely products. Like I feel like they really put some of the best of the best in here. Okay, number seven, this one has a B on it. Bio Lifting Serum Plus. Oh, I don't have this one. I have the Bio Lifting, like the thinner one. I have the cream. I don't have the serum though. So I'm excited for this. It's also a smaller size, but it's beautiful glass bottle as well. I have not tried this one, but I'm really excited about it. Here's number eight. Oh, another, oh, elephant. Okay, this is a shade I actually haven't tried yet because I have it a pile of things I need to try. Not a pile, but you know, like a little area where I keep items to try. And I forgot I haven't tried this yet, but it looks so, so pretty. It's elephant. And this is a shade that's right at my alley. So this is a beautiful, I love all their philanthropy shades. I think they're so beautiful. Nine has these flowers on it. Oh, I get, to, I get excited about everything. It's the purifying and exfoliating phytoactive solution. And I'm so excited because I travel with this. So it's this size. Let me take it out so you can see, because then I can just reuse these containers. And so I always appreciate having a container that looks just like the product itself, but just smaller because when I travel, I forget what's what and like where, I put things so if it looks like the packaging, I will recognize it. So here it is. It looks just like the larger size, but small. Actually, I was just getting my packing ready for that Monos backpack and putting like little minis or um, decanting and kind of pre-packing. And I'm just gonna put all of these in there. It's gonna be really nice. Okay, we've got number 10 because we'll be traveling um, here in a little bit as well. And number 10 has whales on it. Oh, you know what? I was just looking online thinking I've never tried this. This is the lip potion. So it has like a flip lid on it. Okay, and this is what the lip potion looks like. Okay, this definitely is something I wanted to try. Feels really nice. So I'm excited for this. Also excellent for travel. I'm always looking for some kind of like lip balm. Then we have number 11 with the elephant on it. Full brow perfecting gel. I love this. And this I think is this clear, lovely, lovely. 12 with the hummingbird on it. Ooh, and I just started incorporating this because my skin's a little bit drier now that it's getting cooler. The Bio Lifting Cream Plus. Here is the little container. So as with everything else in here, not everything, but most things are gonna go in my uh, travel because yeah, we have a couple trips coming up. That probably is one of the nicest advent calendars I've ever seen because they put in products here. There aren't just like things people don't use. These are things people use and use all the way up. So that's what I really appreciate about this one is there isn't anything bad in here. Everything is beautiful, usable, and gives you a really nice sampling in case you've never used products by Shantikai before. Great place to start. So if you're just getting started with Shantikai and you wanted to try some things, this is a great one for skincare and makeup. I love how they incorporated both. All the products that they included were really well curated. So such a great, great event calendar. But what a fun one to close this vlog with. So thank you again, Shantikai, for sending everything. So I know it's not the end of the year, but I thank you so much, Shantikai, for sending everything that you've sent over this year. I really do appreciate it. I love being able to share the experience and share how everything worked with everyone. One of my very, very favorite companies. So that's it for this vlog. So thank you so much for joining me. If you like these vlogs, I do them every once in a while, but I do probably more sit down videos, but again, more behind the scenes things and more impromptu things like this advent calendar and the holiday collection just coming in. But that is it for today's video. So please take care of each other, stay well. If you enjoyed this video, if you learned something, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and I will see you next time. Bye.